Good morning, YouTube. What is happening? Welcome to Kelly's Garden. It's all well. I'll tell you what. The weather is sweet. Sun's shining. Beautiful food. So I'm gonna kind of call it a commercial job. I'm on a uh, industrial estate. And this is the job for the next few days, folks. So as you can see, it's an industrial estate. Um, pipes have been put on along here. So when they put the pipes on, they've damaged the whole green greenway. So me and John's on, we're going to sort it out. What we're doing is we're rooted it in this area, as you can see. Full of stones. So we're going to root of it and we're going to rake it out, get all this stone out. Not that, for instance. And we're going to get some topsoil in. Do a bit of work on the topsoil and then we're going to sow it with some fresh grass seed. So, as you can see, folks, it's a back job. This is actually 31 metres from that end to this end. Guys, it's a Ferrero. I, I, I read this for these type of jobs. I think these are about 3 or 4 grand, 5 grand brand new. It's a fucking hard fire. As you can see them. So we're going to batter it first for the rotor fitter. This ground's soaking, it's damp. We're going to let a bit of air out and we're going to wreck all the stone out. And then let it dry out. And then we'll get it under some kind of ship. So, stay tuned, folks. Guys, if you're enjoying the content, give us a like for that sunny weather. Hit the thumbs up. Any questions or comments, hit us up. Whew, this is heavy work here, guys. So that's, see, turning topsoil. Stones, rubble. Whew, heavy, heavy grass in the body. So that's, So as you can see here, I'm just I'm breaking all the stones and the mounds as we go along. And then we'll get them in the back of the truck. So we want to some heat folks. Right guys, it's what time? It's 10.25. We got to this job at about 9 o'clock. We had to grab road and stuff, so. This is where we're at. So as I say, my thinking's just get all the rubble and the wee mounds. And then John's loading the wheelbarrow. And he's flying it in the back of the So as you can see, we have wee mounds all over the place here. You might see it better here. Right, so it's all wee mounds. Looks as if some moles have been here, folks. So, um, Happy days, it's really warm. Mm. Um, when John called me about this job, um, so I advised him, we're in stuff of September now, so do you want to get it done ASAP? Especially when the weather's dry now. Do you want this turning into a mucky mess over the next few days? So. Basically doing still sloughing all these mines. I'm 
we're just waiting on top soil landing now. Top soil should be here around 3 o'clock. I'm going to take this rail off here. One of these rails. And then the man with the top soil is going to reverse in. And he's going to dump the top soil here. And then we'll move it from here. Instead of moving it from way down here. So about halfway between everything. I used to work for a team of boys years ago. They would have come in like a wee caboodus. Big wreck bar in the back of it. And you drove up and down here with a wreck on. And that would have grabbed all your dirt and rubble and all your stone and put it on the one pile. So as I see we're doing it manually, we're doing it with wrecks. It's not ideal but we'll get the job done. So I, there's many ways to skin a cat folks. Uh, so there is and this is just the way I'm doing this. Don't get me wrong, I would love a wee bit of this job will be done the day, and that's when then you'd be making really good money, you know. So I've about three days booked in for this job. So we'll spend the day lifting all the stones and rubble. We'll spend tomorrow wrecking on all the topsoil, getting our levels right, and when we'll see what the weather's like. Hopefully Friday we'll get the grass seed down on it and see how it affects folks. Stay tuned. So the soil is drying out a bit. It's actually, when it dries out a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit easier I left shovel in the wheelbarrow. Put some fertilizer on that. I priced them for these bits here, basically. So, and then I come out and this is what about this bit. So I ran over the road of it, and uh, I reckon I can get some grass seed on it. A lot of root here you can see from this tree. Uh. Right guys, that's hot. I'm giving up a garden. No more videos. So we took this gate off. The man reversed done and dropped our topsoil here. Six tonne of topsoil. So we've got six now in the meantime. If we need more, we can get more, but we'll see how this goes. And we'll spread it out. Better looking at it and looking for it, as the man says. So this topsoil we buy it locally off Alec Tree Surgery, Tommy Dunn. And let's see. That not one stone in there boys. Good, good topsoil. Screened and ready to be sewed. Good morning YouTube, day two, we're back on the job. Day two, day two. So guys, as you can see here, we've it all nearly prepped now. Um, most of the prep's done. So, should have had a digger in here. Shite sick, but you love when you learn, folks. You love when you learn. I booked it in for three days. This is my second day, so I think if we get the topsoil out today, we'll see how we're fixing and get, maybe get some grass seed down. So it's supposed to rain on Saturday, so that's why I'm, a, I'm in a kind of a rush here. I want to get the grass seed down and I don't want, as I said, want to turn into a monkey mess. Uh, I'm a bud bath here, so um, stay tuned, folks. Guys, half one, day two. This is where we're at. John's moving topsoil on here. Guys, if you are enjoying this content, the gardening content, help the channel out, give us a wee like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Anytime we upload new videos, you'll get a wee notification. Johnny's Garden Maintenance is on the ball. So I, what well, one folks, yesterday it broke me. I got home last night, I had to lie down in the bath, hot steamy bath, put the feet up and relax. So, um, what one Guys, any UK gardeners out there, um, give us a wee comment in the comments section. Tell us how you would have done this job differently, if you would have done it differently. As I say, I planned it for three or four days. This is day two, and I think we would probably get it pumped today. So uh, let us know, any gardeners on there. We love advice. I love finding out how boys are doing their job. Day two, it's about, I think it's about three o'clock. So 
We are winning, guys. We are winning. Just a wee fad came to my mind there now. Um, September. September's my favourite month for gardening, by far. Just something about September. Something about the air. It's just lovely to be working on outside this time of year. Any gardeners, hit me up in the comments. What's your favourite month of the year without gardening? So, we're nearly there, we're nearly there, we're nearly there. We're winning, we're winning, we're winning. Did it, did it, did it. As you can see, we've made a quail dent in this six ton of topsoil. No body, John. It's looking good, folks. It's looking good. I want to get this gra grass seat down ASAP. And I'm going to bring a roller tomorrow. I'm going to, I'm going to roll the whole area. Just make sure there's good seed to soil contact. I don't want this man ringing me in six weeks time saying there's no grass growing. So happy days folks, stay tuned. Day three folks, we're back. As you can see, just this rolling all this in now. Trying to get as good a seed to soil contact as possible. Stay tuned, folks. Whew, there you have it, folks. Can I see them? Some uh, pre fertilizer on there as well. Put that in. And then I've just watered it there. It's Friday today, it's the rain tomorrow, so hopefully it'll get a good drenching. Just to give you a wee idea. Can I get at this purple water? There's no water source here. So, the rain tomorrow or tonight is forecast. So, please have it, guys. So, I'll be back in six weeks' time to show you the result. Guys, so it's about, I think, three weeks later. I'm sure we've done this job on the 5th of September. Today it's the 29th. I'm going to swing the camera around and show you how it turned out. So the grass has been cut. It was a media cut. I thought this was cut recently. And this is how it turned out, folks. How do you swing that? Too shabby. And as you can see, this is the part that wasn't done here. <coughs> I'll just take these around the other corner now and show you this. Guys, there you have it. That's another video of these. Um, I'm due a break, so um, I'm going to take a few days off because I'm absolutely exhausted. So stay tuned, folks, for more videos coming your way.